you have to go beyond the mind. And immediately you experience the juice, the joy, the love, the power, the silence. And immediately you realize in this place, when you're sitting and you're not thinking, that there is not even death. The concept of death, that's a concept. It doesn't even exist. That death, you die. How can you die? Where would you go? You have to be born in order to die. But you weren't born. You always been here. Where are you going to go? I am is always I am. Now, when I am something, yes, I can die. So if I become a human being and I am a human being, then I can die. But if I don't become something and I stay in my center, then who is going to be born and who is going to die? It, it becomes a concept. It's not real any longer. And I invite you to investigate this. I'm not saying this to you that you just say, oh, wow, great, Zarathustra said some nice things, I really like it. No, I'm not saying these things for you to agree with me. I don't care, I don't give a shit if you agree with me or not. I don't give a shit if you agree with anything I say or you don't. What I really want is for you to investigate it yourself. I want you to come and share this space with me. Come to this place so we can both hang out in this place. I want to share this space because it's limited, unlimited. You can dive into this place and be free, which is beyond death and, and birth. It's silence right now. That, that's why, and I'm going to give you the clue. When we do meditate together, and some of you come and tell me, you know what, it's different to be with you because you're transmitting this thing. I can't do it on my own. Okay? And that's not even true. Because you don't know what you are, and you have no idea who you are. Yes, there is the power of transmission. I agree with it. But the power of transmission is not personal. It's not me transmitting this power to you. Because it's not a person. The transmission, the power of transmission is here. It's between us. It's within yourself. It's surrounding you. It's dancing around you. It's playing around you. It's kissing you. It's touching you. The power of transmission, it's here. You have to be here to get it. You can't be anywhere else. So if you're in a concept of life and death, and you're going to die, and this is going to happen, and COVID-19 is going to come and wipe you out, and blah, 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 then you are not here. You're in a concept. If your mind is busy with U.S. presidency or who's going to win the election, then you're not in silence. You're involved with the world. Gautama Buddha, Jesus Christ, Moses, Muhammad, I don't know, anyone who received arrived at full enlightenment, Krishna. They didn't care about who's in the power, who's running the world, what are the politics of the world. They didn't care about any of that. They discovered the kingdom of heaven within themselves. They were true to their self, and that was their main mission, to find peace inside yourself. In the midst of all this chaotic world, 
and everything is happening, for me, everything is peaceful. It's always quiet. It doesn't matter what happens in the world. Here is always quiet. Here is always peaceful. And maybe that's what you call the power of transmission because you encounter someone, you come across somebody, whomever this person is, and I'm not saying me, in, you're encountering someone who has discovered themselves. And yes, of course, it feels good to be around them because they're emanating that and they're reflecting back that silence to you. So you feel good. But I'm telling you, as I've said it before, what you're looking for is inside yourself. Bring your attention inwards and find peace. And find that you weren't born. And find that you will never die. And all your worries and and anxiety or fear, they all immediately disappear. They're not there anymore. They disappear. So if fear, worry, anxiety comes and goes, then how real is it? How real is it? If it comes and goes. Because if your fear, worry, anxiety is real, it must be there all the time. But it's not. But what is there all the time? Why don't you ex ex examine what's there all the time for you? Look inside. Do it right now. Take a look. Don't take my word. I want you to look inside. What's there inside you all the time? Take a look. Just for one moment, take a look inside. Switch your attention inwards and see what's there all the time. You close your eyes, you bring your attention inwards. You go to the source of your thoughts and you enter into silence. Silence is always here. Inner peace is always here. And if you don't relate it to the events of the world, if you don't attach it to the events of the world, then you will see that you're always in inner peace. If you don't attach it to your news of, from your family, if you don't attach it to the news of your city, if you don't attach it to something, inner peace is always here. So look for that. Seek, seek that. Look for it. Don't settle down for a little crumbs here and there. Look for the big deal. Put the big one inside. Don't be complacent. If things are a little bit going your way and you're happy, that's not enough. Look for that which is permanent inside you. Always. It has to be quiet always and still. Look for that one. Thank you very much for joining me. I went overboard. I went 20 minutes above that. Uh, what I've announced that I'm going to talk. We're going to meet next Wednesday, same time, inshallah, God willing. Um, some of you contacted me regarding my life training program, and I will get back with you. I'm sorry I was gone. And... Uh, <laughs> I haven't checked any messages or anything for the time I was gone. Actually, for about seven days, I didn't even have my phone on. And that was great. 
And I didn't take many photos because I didn't take my phone with me. And that was such an amazing revelation, not having the phone with you. So, but I will get back with you uh, regarding uh, the life training program. Uh, otherwise, I w this recording will be recorded. It will be immediately on Facebook and uh, a uh, edited version of it will be mailed to you in the next few days. Also, uh, we have a podcast and this, re the, this recording is going to be on my podcast as well. And this video is going to be on YouTube. Uh, so you have so many different ways to check it out and watch it again. Um, all of my pages are, uh, the name of my pages are Zaratustra 5D. That's my Facebook, Twitter, uh, YouTube, and um, my podcast. I look forward to seeing you next week, sending you lots of love and light. Feel free to write to me. Uh, my email address is info at zaratustra.tv. I look forward to connecting with you. God bless you and thank you for joining me. Namaste.